Hey friends, happy Monday. So, so I'm here at Walmart. Um, the deals just aren't really dealing at Walmart right now, but <laughs> the other stores, they are. So I wanna go to Rite Aid because of the clearance. Plus with like the Ibotta rebates and I wanna go back to Walgreens. So we're just kind of doing like a, like a big rebate haul. I do have $5 for 18 offers. Um, so that's what I'm going to work on because my other one got a dollar for 15. I don't know. So, um, but I think I'll end up doing more than 18 rebates, um, because I did do two paid with my bodies already, but, um, I'm not picking up a whole lot at Walmart and, um, but, oh, friends, listen. So, um, I wanted to thank you. We hit 12,000 friends, friends. We hit 12,000 friends, friends. So, um, I want to do a giveaway, but now, so this giveaway, you know, I try to be like a little different with my giveaways, but so this one I want to do, um, you have to have Facebook. So, okay. So where are my OG subscribers at? So a lot of you know that I'm a sneaker head. I have a strong love for sneakers. I always have. Um, and there is, um, so one of my friends, well, two, two people that I know, um, that I grew up with, um, opened their own sneaker store in our community, like, like where we grew up. And, um, they also give back a lot to the community. So like, I don't want you to like buy anything from them or anything like that, but the giveaway is going to be for a $50 Walmart e gift card. So what I want you to do, I'm going to have it linked. It's CJ's drip on Facebook. What I want you to do and oh, listen, don't say, well, okay, we'll get to it. Okay. So I'm going to have it in the description box. Um, what I want you to do is go to the page, like their, like follow them, like their page or whatever, and then comment on their most, I guess it's, I guess it would be, so today's Monday. So I know they post like deals of the day. Um, so go find their deal of the day for Monday and then just like that or well, yeah, like, like the picture too. And then just comment coupon mode sent me. That's all I want you to do now they don't know that I have a YouTube channel. A lot of my, like most of my friends have no idea that I have a YouTube channel or my family. Um, so I kind of want to like try to get him out there more because he does do a lot for the community. Um, and, um, so the, yeah, I just want you to say coupon mode sent me. So he doesn't know. So if they, if, now, I don't know how many people are actually going to go over there and, you know, comment and say, coupon mode sent me, you know, but if they say who's coupon mode or anything like that, no response, just don't even respond. I just want to try to, you know, get him, get him around more. You know what I'm saying? Um, so I will announce the winner. Um, when should I announce it? I guess the next time I do Walmart um a walmart rebate haul i might i don't know if it'll be a weekend warrior or next week so whenever i have a walmart in my video that's when i'll announce the winner um i don't know oh and when you like do the comment so if you can um yeah i don't know i don't even know how to do how to like I'll go, I guess I'll go check and maybe verify then that, that you did, like you commented on that photo, you know what I'm saying? And then come back on my video, this one here. Oh my gosh, we're in four minutes. I'm so sorry. Um, come back to this video and then comment done. Don't, don't reply to anything. Just comment its own comment done. And, um, and then, well, I'll, you know, get the $50 e-gift card over to you. Did I make that super confusing? Okay, so this is what you're gonna do. Oh, and also give this video a thumbs up, thanks. So you're gonna go to Facebook, CJ's Trip, like their page or follow their page, whatever it is, then go to the deal of the day for Monday and um, like the photo or whatever, and then comment coupon mode sent me. 
Um, that's it. That's all I want you to do. And then com come back and comment done. And yeah. Okay. So we're going to go in finally five minutes in and get some deals. So let's go. So I do want to give a shout out to G Money for this deal. So I saw she posted a video that these are marked clearance and I had them price check them and they are. So it's the Gentle Skin Cleanser, the 16 ounce. They are scanning in my store for $4.12. So I'm going to pick up three of them because the Ibotta rebate is a limit of three. So three will be $12.36. I'll submit to Ibotta for $2.50 back on each one. Plus, I should also hit a $0.75 cent bonus as well as a $1.50 bonus. Should make three of them only $2.61. The Lysol Air is included in a promotion for buy two, you're gonna get back $2 in bonus cash and it is a limit of two. So I'm gonna pick up four of them. That's gonna to total me $29.96. I have a 50 cent digital coupon, so I'll pay $29.46 but I'll get back $4 in bonus cash for doing the deal twice. Then I'm going to complete my bonus cash challenge for Lysol. So I'm going to get back another $7. And I'm also going to submit to Ibotta for $3 back on each one. Makes four of them just $6.46. So this is what my cart is looking like for my first transaction. All of this is going to total me $42.32. I only have a 50 cent digital coupon and I'm also going to have the cashier scan that in ad booster for spend 40 get back $10 in bonus cash. So I should end up paying $41.82 but I'll get back $14 in bonus cash, 10 for the booster, 4 for the Lysol, $7 in bonus cash challenge money and a total of $21.75 I should get back from Ibotta. Should make everything here a 93 cent money maker. So thank you to Charlie for telling me that some of the clearance squincy is triggering the $10 in bonus cash. So I'm going to grab three of them. So I found one clearance for $1.49, one for $3.12, and one for $1.99. So that should total me $6.60. If I get back the $10 in bonus cash, that'll make all three of these a $3.40 moneymaker. Okay. I'm going to grab four of these Clairol Root Touch-Ups. So these are clearanced at $2.49. So four of them will total me $9.96. We have an $8.99 off of two digital coupon. So since I'm buying over that $8.99 um, cent amount, that digital coupon will come off. So that should lead me to pay 97 cents out of pocket, but then I'm going to submit to Shopmium and get back $5 for the other two. So that'll make four of them a 403 moneymaker. So my store isn't tagged, but um, Select Carmex is buy one, get back a th or get back $3 in bonus cash. That is a monthly deal. It's a limit of four. I haven't done it at all on this card. So I'm going to grab four of these two packs here, the watermelon at $4.49 each, and I'll get back $3 in bonus cash for each one. It makes them $1.49 each. I found this Head and Shoulders Clinical Clearance for $3.12. We do have a $3 Ibotta rebate. Makes that just 12 cents. I wasn't at uh, $40 yet, so I added in one of these delicious Quest Bars for, I think it was like $4.29, but it has a freshness peely on it. So for everything here, this is going to total me $41.53. I have $9.49 in coupons. So it's $8.99 for the Clairol, as well as um, $0.50 cents for the uh, Quest Bar. So that's going to bring my total down to $32.04, but I should get back $32 in bonus cash, which is $10 for the booster, um, 10 for the Scuncy and 12 for the Carmex. But remember, I'm also going to submit to Shopmium for $5 back for the other two Clairol, as well as $3 on Ibotta for the head and shoulders. So that should end up making everything here a $7.96 moneymaker. This Dollar Shave Club Body Razor is clearance for $4.99. We do have a $4 digital coupon, makes it just $0.99. Cents. 
I ended up finding more clearance scunzi. Um, I did not do this deal on this card and it is a limit of two. So what I'm going to do is actually pick up six of them. So these six products should total me an even $12, but I should get back $20 for doing the deal twice. Makes all of this an $8 money maker. Select Arm & Hammer is on a promotion for buy two. You're going to get back $3 in bonus cash and they're on sale for $8.99. So I'm going to grab one of the liquids for $8.99 and one of the pods for $8.99. That'll total me $17.98. I'm going to get back $3 in bonus cash and I'll submit to Ibotta for $4 back on the liquid. Makes both of them $10.98. These 7th generation uh, trash bags are clearance. They're ringing in at $2.24. So I'm just going to add this into my transaction. I found one of the Flonays um, clearance for $4.24. I'm, I am going to use that $5 coupon that we got in the $4.21 save. That will give me $0.76 cents of overage. So now for everything combined, this is going to put me at $41.45. I have $9 in coupons, $5 for the Flonays, $4 for the Dollar Shave Club. So that should bring my total down to $32.45, but I should get back a total of $33 in bonus cash. 10 for the booster, 20 for doing the Scuncy deal twice, as well as $3 for the Arm & Hammer. Then I'm going to submit to Ibotta for $4 back on the liquid. We'll make everything here a $4.55 moneymaker. So this was a really nice find on this Toffee Fay. So these are clearanced for $0.89. Cents. I'm going to grab four of them for $3.56. We have a rebate on swag bucks for $3 back when you buy two and you can do it twice. So since I'm getting, since I'm picking up four, I'll get back $6. Then I'm also going to submit to checkout 51 for 75 cents back on each box. That should make all four of these a $5 and 44 cent money maker. Well, this is a way better deal at CVS this week. But I'm just going to pick it up. So the um, family size General Mills cereals are $3.99 each. I'll grab two for $7.98. I do have a dollar off of two digital, so I'll pay $6.98. And then I'll submit to Ibotta for a dollar back for buying two. Makes it $5.98 for both. So this is not the best deal, but again, we're going for those rebates, okay? So these are priced at $1.99 each. The limit on Ibotta is five. So I'm actually gonna grab five of them. I'm gonna get back 30 cents for each one. And I'm also gonna submit to Fetch. I'll get back 40 cents for each one. And that one is a limit of three. Okay, so we have some copper fit on clearance, and I know I've seen people get them. Um, I've seen them get the socks, but I don't know what else is included. So I'm going to try and see what happens. Um, so I'm going to grab, so actually these are clearance for $3.24. They are on a uh, monthly promotion for buy one, get back $3 in bonus cash. I believe it's a limit of four. I didn't even double check. I hope it's a limit of four. But I'm going to grab four of them at $3.24 each. But if I get back the $12 in bonus cash, that makes them just $0.24 cents a pack. Okay, so this was my transaction, um, but it didn't work out like I thought. So um, I did end up returning some stuff. Like I didn't get the bonus cash for the Squincy because I did find some more clearance stuff. And then I only got um, $6 back for the Copper Fit. So I ended up returning some of the stuff, but with the other deals, I still wanted to share this um, with you. I've been really, really wanting to try this new Dove Cherry Scented Bar Soap. Um, let me know if you've tried it. Um, I also do really want to try that exfoliating one. I've never tried that one either. But um, Dove products are on a promotion for buy two. You're going to get back a $5 register reward. And I believe they range from $7 to $10. But I'm going to go for the bar soap. So I'm going to grab one of the women's for $10. Then I also picked up one of the Dove Men's. Those are also $10. So this will total me $20. I do have a $5 off of two digital coupon. So I'll pay $15. I'll get back the $5 register reward. 
And then I'm gonna submit to Fetch. I do only need 10 more dollars to get back another $4 for spending um, the 15 at Walgreens on Dove Men products. So that's gonna make these just $3 each. Uh, I just really need some of these small garbage bags and they are on sale for $1.99 each. So I'm gonna grab two of them. So I found this uh, John Frieda clearance for $1.39. And I have a rebate on Ibotta for $2 back. Makes that a little 61 cent money maker. So now for everything here, that's going to put me at $25.37. And I do have a digital booster for spend 25, get back seven. So the only coupon I have is the $5 digital for um, the Dove Bar Soap. So that should bring my total down to $20.37 getting back $7 in Walgreens cash, a $5 register reward, $4 from Fetch, and $2 on Ibotta should make this only about $2. Check your stores for uh, Clearance CoverGirl. Um, these are $4. You can submit to Ibotta for $2 and then to Shopmium for $3. That would make this a $1 moneymaker. Um, I did not bring any of my coupons with and I already used my Shopmium reimbursements. So um, this one actually doesn't exclude coupons. So this could be a really great deal. So this is a repeat deal. This deal just keeps on resetting and resetting and my dog loves it. So I'm just going to do it. But they're still on rollback for $1.06. I'm going to submit to Ibotta for 50 cents back. It is a limit of five. So I'm going to max it out. I'm going to grab two of these uh, soft baked cereal bars. <laughs> they're $3.42 each. Two of them will total me $6.84. I'm going to submit to Ibotta for a dollar back on each one. And then I only need $4.09 yet to get um, $2 back on Fetch. So that will make two of these boxes just $2.84. So my daughter just really wants some Fruity Pebbles. So I'm going for the one price at $3.77. And I'm going to submit to Ibotta for $0.50 cents back. That's going to end up making this $3.27. All right, so here we are with today's goodness. Um, so I do want to go over the transaction that got messed up first. Um, that I didn't like the scuncy I didn't get back, and what else? Oh, that copper fit. So I'm gonna show you the receipt for that, and then because and then I have the return and. So here are all five of my bubbly. Here is the scunzi that I returned, my toffee fay, the more scunzi, the two copper fit, um, the two socks, the Cheerios, my digital. So that was $40.88, but then I ended up returning um, this stuff, so $13.91. So the forty eighty eight minus the thirteen ninety one puts me at twenty six ninety seven, but I got back the sixteen dollars in bonus cash, and I submitted to Swagbucks, so it didn't pick it up. But then it had me um, like scan the barcode for the toffee fay, and then it said something about um, that I was approved for three dollars, but then it said it would credit in a couple days, but then it showed pending for a dollar. So then I messaged them and I said, and I explained that, you know, it's buy two, get three, and I got four, so I would get back six. So um, then they messaged me back saying, oh, we credited you on the amount that you requested, but they gave me a hundred swag bucks. So yeah, I don't know. I don't know. So I did respond back, but I'm only counting the one swag buck that I got back for the Toffee Faye. But I did get back the $2 or um, the $3 from Checkout 51. Um, I also got back $1.28 from Fetch plus the $2.50 from Ibotta. Ends up making this transaction a cost of $3.19. And I'll take that just for those two big boxes of cereal. So that was the mess up. And then um, let's go the next one. This was my Cetaphil and Lysol deal. So um, there's the three Cetaphil and then all five Lysol. Really simple, 50 cent digital. I paid $41.82. 
I got back the $14 in bonus cash, which is 10 for the booster and four for doing the Lysol deal twice. Then I will get back $7 for my Lysol bonus cash challenge. And I ended up getting back $21.75 from Ibotta. So it ends up making my first transaction a 93 cent money maker. Now for my other transaction, I did four transactions at Rite Aid and they were all done at four different stores. So here are my four hair colors. There's my load to card coming off, the head and shoulders, the Quest Bar, the Carmex, and the Scunzi. There's that $50 freshness peely. So that brought my total down to $32.04. And I did get back $32 in bonus cash, which is 10 for the booster, 20 for, or 10 for the Scunzi and um, 12 for the Carmex. And this put me over $2 in points. Plus I submitted to Shopmium for the other two Clairol and I submitted to Ibotta for the head and shoulders. So that ends up making that transaction a $9.96 money maker. Now my last transaction at Rite Aid. So there's the Dollar Shave Club razor, my load to card coming off, the Flonase, and that coupon scan again, no problem, but it went down there at the bottom. So I'm wondering if that's what the new one is doing. If the newer one is going to the bottom, because the other one went underneath just fine. There's the clearance seventh generation trash bags. Um, and I have six Scunzi products here and then the two Arm & Hammer. So this brought my total down to $32.45 and I got back um, $33 in bonus cash. Plus I submitted to Ibotta for $4 back on the Arm & Hammer. Makes that transaction a $4.55 money maker. Now over to Walgreens, I have um, the two trash bags, the two Dove, and the John Frieda. So I did use a $5 register reward to help lower my out of pocket, but my $5 digital for the Dove did come off. So if you add in the register reward I use, that puts my subtotal at $20.37. And then I did get back $7.37 for my digital booster. And I also got back the $5 register reward. And then I submitted to Fetch. I did get back the $4 for um, the Dove Men's Bar Soap. Then I submitted to Ibotta. I got back $2 for the uh, John Frieda. So it makes my Walgreens haul just $2. And I really, really, really wanted that. So that was awesome. Okay, and last but definitely not least is Walmart. Um, so there's the Fruity Pebbles, the two um, bars, and then five dog foods. So that put my total at $15.91. Um, and I submitted to Ibotta, I got back a total of $10. That includes my $5 uh, midweek money maker. And I submitted to Fetch, so it only picked up one of these somehow. So I tried to correct my receipt. I don't know why I do that because I always have much better luck if I just contact them. So I'll get back another $2 from Fetch. Makes my cost at Walmart only $3.91. So uh, I was gonna pick up the twin brow pencils, um, but they must've fell out of my cart. And um, yeah. And I, I didn't, I guess I didn't even take a picture of it, but those are $4.47. We have $2 back on Ibotta and $3 back on the Shop Me a Map. That makes that like a 53 cent money maker. So I had um, three costs today, one of $3.19, one of $3.91, and one of $2. And then if you take that, subtract that from all of my money makers, that ends up making everything on this table a $6.34 money maker. So awesome, awesome deals this week going on. That is what I have for you today. Thank you so, so much for watching. I will see you in my next video. And until then, stay in coupon mode. Bye friends.